In this quick tutorial, I'm going to show you how to take an unstructured FrameMaker document and structure it. I've already restarted my FrameMaker after going to Preferences and changing to the product interface of Structured FrameMaker. So that's already done. If I look at my document, I can go over here to the XML Structured Workspace and in here look at this structure view and see I have no structure and no elements. So in order to structure this, one of the easiest ways to do it is to go over Structure, choose Utilities, and generate what's called a conversion table. This is going to take the styles that I have in here and generate a table with matching elements that I can now slam back into my document. So I'll take this document. It's important to save it. I'm just going to call it CT for conversion table. And I'm going to go back to my fighter document and I'm going to apply the structure. I'm going to come back to utilities and choose structure current document. It's going to ask me for some type of conversion table. I add the structure and it's now a structured document. It's that easy. If I come over here, I can see that I have lots of structure and I also have elements. Now there's a lot more work to do, especially in this conversion table. I hope you enjoyed this quick tip on Structured FrameMaker.